invited me to go cruising and I never go so the first time that I go I'm like in a badass mood and we go whatever we go to this car meet <clears throat> and we have mutual friends obviously so the friends that my friend knows I obviously know and um and we went I went with her and her husband and we're at this stop we go to this car wash and we're stopped at this car wash and um he's there <laughs> he's getting off with this truck and I asked I'm like who's that and they said they're like oh that's China and I was like well who's China like I've never seen this guy in my life before so so yeah so then we just kind of like eye contact and that was it and then I was like oh, I'm not feeling it I want to go home already and then they were like no we're gonna go get something to eat so we're going to this little fast food place and we're all sitting <clears throat> We're all sitting down and then he comes to and he sits next to me and then <laughs> it was awkward because we weren't even talking at all and um and my phone goes off and it's like a facebook notification so then i grab my phone i look at it and he sends me a friend request like as we're sitting there next to each other so i'm looking at it and i'm like <laughs> like is this you or not and yeah we went home and then from there it started he was just liking my pictures and we, there you go it's uh, a jewelry box that he made me it's just a cute little jewelry box on the top it says I love you <laughs> and on the sides it says my name let's go open and close it and then this is supposed to be a flower pot but obviously I'm not going to put flowers in it so this is a cute little bag <laughs> this call is from a person. You will not be charged for this call. This call is from Carlos Valdez. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. To accept, to accept this, this call, call press, press 5. To... You may begin speaking now. Hello. Hey babe, nothing just here. I'm getting my inter our interview done. <laughs> Why are you laughing? Huh? <clears throat> so far, so far, so good. I'm showing them the um the jewelry box you made me <clears throat> the little heart shaped of cards you made me the pictures the cards um yeah just pretty much everything that you've made me all your arts and crafts is that recording right now? i am <laughs> yeah do you want to share a good experience you've had so far <laughs> Any good experience you've had in this long ride you've been doing? Well, just having you by my side is a good experience. Oh, <laughs> that's cute. You're cute. Can you hear me? I said I love you. <clears throat> I love you too. Um. So these are the cards that he made me when he was in jail. <laughs> so there's that one. There's that one. There's, well actually it's upside down. This is on Valentine's Day. It says Happy Valentine's. There's another one. These two little pears. I think this is our anniversary one, I think. No, it wasn't. Sorry. It's just a normal one. It's another one that one of his friends made of us. It just says this. One. We recently went to go see him. This other one. 
Miss Glenn, my mother-in-law, she came with us. This one. Yeah, those are the recent pictures that I have of us. So we are married. We did get married. We got married at a really young age. Um, I got married when I was 19. He was 18. Um, <clears throat> we did talk about getting married before he went to prison. Obviously, just given the circumstances, that was put on pause. Um, we had mentioned it to our families, but both from like both sides, they were like, oh, you guys are too young. You guys are going to make it. All that. So we ended up going behind everyone's backs and we got married. And then <laughs> obviously the mail that came in both of our names together, it obviously threw it away. So, so yeah, we've been married for um i want to say four years and going we're gonna be locked in for a lifetime yeah that's just another day in the life of a prison wife my job is so easy <laughs>